Hi guys, so this is going to be a demonstration of video of how I built a lens cap for a lens that I bought, the one that I actually, I'm actually using to make that video. So uh, this is going to be the final thing and I'm going to assemble it in front of you. It's all 3D printed, it only has got one spring that will drive the whole thing. And so this is similar to how it's going to look like. As you can see it's got the spring in action, it works like any other lens cap you can buy commercially. They were just uh, a bit on the expensive side and you want to spend the money and I have a 3D printer so I think I'm going to print one. So this is how it should look or close to what it should be and those are first, second prototype. There's a bunch of other that I probably threw up, threw away but <clears throat> you can see them. So let's start with the assembly. So those parts all click fit together. They have, let me see if I can zoom in so I can see it better. So all the parts are designed so they will fit together. And once they jump over a ledge, they shouldn't, you shouldn't be able to pull them back. So it should be like so. They're hard to put in intentionally. So this is one button and as you can see it moves. Then, uh, then we have another one. Put that in. It's really hard to put in because it's it's made to be. Okay, we get the second one in. I gotta do a bit more, a bit clean up because usually part of the plastic goes when you do that. So, but that's to be expected. It's actually made to be like that, so it's fine. Then we're gonna be putting the spring here in the middle. And nope, let me put it back in. So this is what it looks like and how it moves. And you have that side on the side is grooved like any other lens cap. So that's pretty much it. I'm gonna be gluing up that thing, which I just call the spring cover. And once I have that glued into place to actually hold the spring, it's it's all done. So this is the last part of the video where we, I can show you how the cap actually fits on the lens it, I made it for. It fits like any other cap wood. It actually holds pretty sturdy, it doesn't move. It's not easy to pull it out, you can, like any Nikon cap, but it works. So this is made for a 55mm uh, diameter lens. So it, this one is a 2880. It's a really cheap Nikon lens that it's from back in the day, but it's pretty decent for for some purposes and it's it's cheap. So this is my cap and this is an Nikon cap. Let me flip it around. They have a very similar function. They kind of look similar underneath. I wouldn't say the same way, but they look similar. So this is it, I'm gonna wrap up the video with this and see you next time.